Ooh, deliciousness bonus. Zero. <laughs>
Oh, you can only do so many at a time. HS is holding station, so it's just it's just getting them ready. Oh, I can flip between my holding stations there to, to whip together the next batch of pretz pretzels. Oh no! Throw them out! <laughs> they wanted German pretzels. That was my bad. That wasn't a great start. They just, for, for whatever reason, just assumed everyone was going to want all the same. We're arriving at the next stop. You need to serve customers their hot pretzels as soon as they want them. No waiting whatsoever. You can see that it's starting to tick down. They're only good for a certain amount of time. They eventually, like, expire, I guess would be the right word. So you don't want to prep your food too early? Or else some of it will start going bad? Alright guys, does everyone just want regular- these are just regular classic pretzels, correct? Uh, these were classics as well? Does it not seem to matter? It seems like everyone's just willing to take whatever it is I give them and they're all just happy with that. I guess I shouldn't have prepared all those extra ones either. Oh, this guy- okay, they're starting to want more particular things. Uh, clothes? Oh, jeez. Alright, I'm falling behind here. I'm just gonna I, toss those in the trash. No one actually wanted them. But my my nice little cone is all ready to go. Dip cone. Mint chocolate. Two scoops. Perfection. And more. Okay, we're, we're back to making Holden, Holden Station pretzels. No! Throw them away! <laughs> Damn it! I'm making the wrong things again. Oh god, we're like arriving at the next station already. Uh... You can also call Whisk and Cleaver to help serve orders. Flick the right stick in any direction to get them to auto-serve all orders that are ready. Oh, but I would have to trust them to, to not blow it. How do I do that? I feel like I'm flicking right stick. Are they not... How do I... How do I get them doing that? Guys, oh, there we go. Oh, okay, it, it, it just took a bunch being ready, was I think was the main thing that was holding that back. Uh, I'm just waiting so impatiently. Come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Nice. So it immediately checks them all off to let you know, like, okay, these are in the holding station. It checks them off to let you know they're ready to go, and then flick, serve that stuff all up. Great work. Try doing this next stop on your own. Open up a holding station. Am I getting pulled over? Or take uh, take some special orders. Uh, wh wh what do you want here, man? There's too too much going on. I don't have time to worry about all all this ridiculousness. And uh, there's so many like new things to be learned that it's all about like learning the rhythm of the different particular things. And that's just something that I don't know currently. I I didn't I didn't mean to dip it. It's gonna be uh, an imperfect order. Imperfect order. <laughs> Uh, this guy, this guy does want the dip, and then praline? What a stupid flavor, man. Why would it- get out of my restaurant. <laughs> like, who- who would ever want that? That's a, the, the most boring-ass flavor of all time, and I, I- I won't allow that sort of rookie stuff to be a, a, around my restaurant. I- I- no, 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 pick it up. Oh, crap, I have to finish this one first. All right, rocky road then. Uh, serve, serve the orders. Oh no, I didn't holding prep anything. Uh, <laughs> I have nothing ready to go. Oh no, I don't know where Rocky Road is. And Cookie Dough, take it, take it. Uh, must get pretzels. <laughs> I, I didn't, it told me to do it all on my own and I misunderstood what it was asking of me. I thought it would let me know if, if people were going to want pretzels. Uh, I should have just known. I should have gotten like every single thing <sighs> making pretzels right away well that was a huge huge oversight by me like i just buy far and away didn't have enough to go around didn't have the chance to finish my whatever they're called ice cream cones <laughs> because i was too busy like focusing on the wrong things uh, do i need one more order of that no 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 that's uh i've 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 got gotten enough at this point i didn't realize that uh i couldn't like interrupt a cone so it's like putting them all in the waffle iron as quickly as that is almost a mistake because you would have to make one so, so quickly to get the other cone in time before it burnt. Bronze. I mean, I think that's like the minimum while still passing. Oh, seven. Seven angry. Idaho potato skins? Is that uh, the currency here? Ooh, deliciousness bonus. Zero. <laughs>
Things weren't very delicious. They were cooked and served. Not particularly delicious. Oh, it really uh, brings you back and makes you realize how frantic this game is and realistically always has been. So there's so many, there's all these different locations just on this basic route. And then there there was like 10 different routes that you could do. So there's like, and then each stop has multiple things you can do. So yeah, there's like well over 100 levels. Or at least like a little bit over, but they're they're adding even more beyond that. So there's just so much to do with the game. That didn't go great, but I'm gonna try Simply Solids. I prefer when you can kind of set your own menu the way you do in, in these games sometimes. And then once you've set your menu, you can get... I mean, there was only like two things. There was pretzels and ice creams. I should have been fine. But you get like familiar with the rhythm and you start to like remember the menu layout a little bit. All right, standard mode, chill mode, turns on infinite patience for customers and turns off food truck attacks. I I'm gonna play on standard because I wanna see what food truck attacks are like. I was kinda joking before, but now I'm thinking maybe there is some Mad Max food truck nonsense that goes on. We can build up today's menu. Good, this is what I was wanting. I have to have six different foods on the menu though? All right, that's not gonna help me do any better. <laughs> Oh, they've analyzed our route and selected the best foods for for us. Blank meringue? Is that what that is? Chicken nig fops are going on there for sure. They probably just have to be dunked in a fryer. That's about it. Falafel, give people a, a veggie option. Hmm, if I do churros, that would be another fried item. I feel like I probably don't want everything utilizing the same equipment. That's kind of a thing. Theory, I don't know for sure. Grilled cheese, I bet, is going to be very simple. Uh, crab legs sounds complicated. Kimchi, jerk chicken. I already have chicken on the menu. I honestly don't know if your customers analyze things like that. But I'm going to have the kimchi. And then marshmallow squares? I already have a sweet option. Crab legs seems absurd. But maybe it's just cooked and then with or without lemon? Like, it might be something really simple. Uh, and I don't really know what's up with this soupy option whatever fine we'll put the the japche on it who knows how one would speak, say such a such a word oh there's like a stress that builds up man after a day is complete all your funds will be transferred into crumb coin the leading cryptocurrency for all food purchases the amount of dollars it takes to buy one cc is noted in the exchange rate below your cash earned Funds left over after buying CCs automatically carried over to the next day. And you can like improve your food truck and things like that, presumably, because that's how it worked for the restaurants. All right, immediately gonna get the holding station going. Uh, people are gonna want brownies, so brownie batter goes in and cook. Okay, dope. I'm excited to learn that they're relatively simple overall. Uh, strips, 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 and, and dunk, dunk that. And uh, I'll, I'll get a falafel thing going as well. Falafel, falafel, falafel. And dunk! And dunk! Oh, I'm hitting the wrong buttons! Ah! <laughs> How the hell do I do this? You, he, he wanted everything, so I can get that started. And you also just want everything. Get that started. Okay. Oh man, my brownies are going bad. I actually think I started the brownies too soon. Okay, we're, we're starting a new brownie batch because those ones are just going to be junked. Ha ah, ah, ha! That stuff's getting ready too fast. Uh, good. I, I, you know, I'm pumped when people just want everything. Crap, oh, I can't serve that anymore. We're arriving. Oh, oh, people. No, I, I do have enough of everything, I think. Well, I guess I'm making an extra batch because I just kind of need to, bah, serve, serve everything that everyone actually wants. Okay. Having, having Whisk and Cleaver available to do this stuff for me is awesome. Uh, I don't think I meant to do this so I guess I'm cook, uh, cooking another batch somewhat unintentionally. Ha, <laughs> ha. No. Oh, no, no, no. I, I thought I had fluffles ready to go. Dang it. I, uh, I, mu I must have gone through them all already. Dunk it. Get it in there. Okay. Okay. You're, it, it, it adds some patience. Uh, people are willing to wait when they know it's sitting in the holding station, like, waiting for them. Because that guy was, like, about to bail on me. <laughs> I got a little too panicky and, like, wasn't properly analyzing, like, the orders people are expecting versus, like, what I have sitting, waiting, ready to go. And so I was kind of having difficulties there where I was making things that people didn't want or need. Oh god. Okay, complicated. Butter. Bread. Bah. Butter. 
<laughs> do I just do I just do it? Is that is that all I needed? Is that cooked? I, I felt like there was too much going on and I didn't have time to fully analyze uh, whether or not I was doing that correctly. A everyone, everyone, sit tight. I got brownies in the oven. Okay, I I'm making new falafels because those other ones are about to go bad. Serve, serve. Everyone, eat your deliciousness. Whew. Back on, back on the road. Oh, people want brownies like crazy. I'm not getting pulled over, am I? Uh, is this just a matter of doing this sequence? I, I don't know. I, this seems like it's all that it is. I don't know. Like, when, the, when those cops ping me like that, I get all flustered because I think something bad's happening. And it does seems like nothing nothing's coming of it. Now, now I feel like I'm getting into the rhythm. Now I'm feeling a lot more confident in things. If someone does a thing where they ask for, like, no spinach on one of those, I'm going to wig out because I'm, like, not going to be able to do it properly. Oh, I think I accidentally... That order was, like, half-cooked. And I stuck it into, like, a heating tray. It was, like, right... Yeah. So, that was bad. Damn it. I, I, I let so much food go bad. Uh, chicken, chicken, chicken. Oh, serve. Serve all that stuff. I almost, like, didn't serve it properly. Okay. Get it in there. Okay. It's all looking good, guys. This is it. Get some brownies in the oven again. Falafels. Uh... <laughs> I didn't mean to make one single one. <laughs> well, that felt like a waste. Uh, but maybe that maybe that was fine. Maybe maybe he felt like he was being treated extra. You know, made to order specifically for you, sir. Please enjoy. Uh, get, get some chicken strips in there. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All right, is there any? Okay, I don't have enough brownies to go around, so I got to get an order of brownies in there as well. <sighs> Luckily, most people are satisfied with, like, the standardized orders. Most people aren't going for uh, things too crazy. Or, like, by too crazy, I mean, like, grilled cheese. The way out there order of grilled cheeses. Damn. My my biggest slip-up was, I think, putting the lid on that one that wasn't ready yet. Uh, so that one might was either the bad one or okay one. And then I'm not sure entirely what else I might have screwed up. I got level up. I don't know if that means I got like a tech upgrade or something. I'm curious to see what kind of things I could I can spend this on now. There's like those red zones that you can't go to at all. I don't really know why Texas gets specifically singled out like that. No idea. Oh, I can't. I can't upgrade just yet. And trinkets, I'm sure that'll be a part of the full release. This is a bit of like an early, a bit of an early look. Oh, man. All right. It's very difficult to stay on top of things when you're getting flustered so easily. Three-point menu. I'm doing standard. I'm sticking with it. This menu has a three-point requirement. You'll need to purchase some higher-level foods, buy and place at least three Tier 1 foods on your menu. The number at the top right of each food indicates its tier, its difficulty. Dang! didn't realize like everything I was serving was like low difficulty like that oh, I just, so now all of a sudden my holding station stuff is getting more complicated I kind of want beignets on there strictly because of the movie chef so it, th there's a real chance I, I do that I, I, I'm doing it I'm putting a beignet on there oh I accidentally just went to uh, practicing it all right well let's see let's see what it what it asks of me. I'm pretty sure it's as simple as like getting it in the fryer and then uh, you probably have to like shake some some powder on top of it once it's done cooking with sugar served with sugar served okay that's tough because you can't like auto you can't auto serve that I don't think with the the like helper robots ladies Oh god, I'm hitting the wrong buttons. There's so many. You have to utilize like every damn button on the controller to pull off any of this. It just starts to freak you out a little bit. Oh, I, I haven't even purchased it, so I would have to purchase that first. Ooh, I'm gonna look around at some of the other things. There's so many options. Aw, oh, poutine. Ah, oh, I want it because of the Canadian-ness of it. How much does it cost? One? One thing? Sure. Add to today's menu? Awesome. Beignets entirely just because of chef. 
I liked doing the grilled cheese. I'm keeping that. Oh, the kimchi actually was super easy as well. And it's making me, making me get one more level. Ooh, I could get the onigiri that, like, I don't know, Ash Ketchum, like, entirely sustains himself on. Like, it's the only, only thing that guy eats. I'm adding it to the menu. It just seems like it's a ball of rice with a little, a little seaweed handle. Seems like it's about as simple as it could get. All the gas you earn in the day also counts towards YUM, which stands for Your Universal Mastery. By earning enough YUM, you'll level up, which will earn new, your new parts for your food truck, each part to add an upgrade, uh, uh, upgrading your truck. <laughs> I think it also said you can only start upgrading at like level five, or something near that at least. All right, getting, getting my fries in there. I meant to do brownies first because I noticed that a lot of people appear to be asking for brownies. I probably want a little bit of everything at least though. Uh, but I'll get one extra, I meant to, well, I guess that's what I'm doing. I meant to get an extra order of brownies in. Like God, I just can't stay on top of things for longer than like a second. We're halfway there. Hopefully that's a uh, far enough way that all the holding station. Add, imprint, stuff, shape, nori. Okay, is that all that, that needs of me? Oh man, my brownies. My brownies are gonna go off already? That stinks. I do like these that are just a matter of like doing a very particular sequence and I don't think it's ever, uh, it's ever going to be a different requirement. Like, no one's gonna ask you to not imprint it. I didn't realize they were stuffed though. So there's definitely like something going on in there, which is, uh, adds to the general appeal. Oh shit, okay, so do I, I actually have to like do things with, uh, I have to like make some of these now actually. Like poutine actually needs to be made. Oh God, too many things all at once. Uh, oh no, 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 I actually have to make the beignets as well. That's why that's like, not happening. Ha, 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 I'm not, I'm not doing well. <laughs> no, gotta get a poutine. I, I'm not, I don't, I don't even have time to check, like, what, how specifically these guys like it or want it. Ah, oh, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. No, I want more in there. Don't just make one single one that's foolish when that happens. Okay, yeah, get, get out, get out the brownies. Get everyone their delicious browns. Uh, that's, that's probably about to be tossed. I don't think, I don't know if that was ready or not. I love watching you work, Chef. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Thank you for the general support, I suppose. I, on the other hand, am wigging out. It's, it's a, a tough, tough go out here. Life on the road. Harsh, unforgiving, scary, full of panic. Uh, no, oh, I'm gonna lose food quality. Okay, good. Whew, whew. <laughs> Turns out I'm a master. Oh, okay. Serve up everything you can. What, 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 what do I need more of here? I don't know, man. Just get something, something in the, 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 the place, into the fryer. Serve, serve. <laughs> I take care of the delicious. You guys get out there and serve, okay? Okay. It's a, it's a perfect synergistic relationship that I have with these robots. Oh my god. Uh, everyone wants brownies, and I just always hit the wrong button and end up making something else. They, they wanted like nothing but brownies. I'm tossing those, whatever, they're gonna, th I, I got a new batch in there. It seems like a waste. I, I don't know if the game punishes you for just chucking out food like that, but uh, I think I kind of needed to. I was, I was hoping like one of these like road warrior battles was gonna come up here. Do you know what? I'm just tossing that. I'm getting a new thing of beignets going. I just feel like uh, it was too, too risky that if I was still halfway away, they were gonna expire too soon anyways. This, I can get the hang, th these are okay. Those are like simple enough that I can, I can manage doing these like simple orders. All right, I immediately can queue all that up for everyone. Perfect, I want I wanted the brownies served as quick as I could like that so I could get new brownie orders in. Good, okay, don't overthink it. Just do like the singular thing that they're asking for. All right, that one's gonna go away faster than the rest. Ah. Come on, one more. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, 
That was dope. I, I, I didn't miss an order on that one. But I, I must I must be uh, running out of things. All right, new new beignets. Uh, ba, 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 ba. <laughs> okay, good. That gives me, it gives me just the tiniest bit extra time when I when I get an order in like that. Oh no! Don't don't throw that out. Don't throw that out. No! Don't make fries either. That's not what I want. <laughs> no! It was going so well so briefly. Oh wait! Throw that out. Get some brownies in there and try and add some extra time. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. It's so frantic. Serve it. <laughs> oh, you better remain delicious though. Oh god, I have so much more things than I need. That was the that was the last stop. Okay, I couldn't even like register if there if there was more coming up after that or not. Not bad. Not bad. <laughs> uh, not bad. One one bad order. No. How do I get perfect? How do I make people so ecstatic? I don't know how much control I, I have over that, if any. Ah. Oh. I don't know how to make them happier. Easy street, easy street they call it. Oh, you have to unlock, but for most of them, for most of them it's just a matter of like completing levels at all. Like, uh, no, maybe not. Oh, interesting, you have to start traveling around to other points. Like you can't just, I can't just work my way all the way through harmonica, cause I, there's three levels here, only one here. Like I need at least five, I think. Oh, but I do have two silvers. I don't know. It, it, you you can start doing things a little bit out of order is the main thing that I'm gathering from that. Uh, no, don't quit. Upgrade the truck until I reach Yam rank five. Dang, because I was kind of interested to like show that off now if if that were an option. It's, there's just so so much food. I'm just kind of cruising through to just show how out of control the menu actually is. I've made a collective like 10 different items at most in this episode and there's just so much. There's a full local co-op, which is cool. I would consider messing around with that, like trying that out, just seeing how that goes. I don't intend to make this like a series because I honestly, I honestly really enjoy the Cook, Serve, Delicious like franchise so much, but it's so hard to provide commentary for because it's as frantic as it is. It has a really Really, really fun quality to just lock in, laser focus, no commentary, and just try to do orders. Try to try to serve, try to serve, try to serve. So I, I don't normally do this one as like a series because it's difficult and stressful, and I enjoy the game so much just playing it like privately and quietly. So yeah, that's Cook Serve Delicious 3, January 29th. I'll have a link down below. You guys can either go wishlist it or buy it, depending on when this video comes out. Uh, I'm excited about it. I hope you are too. I think they came up with some clever ways to, to reinvigorate the series. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you again soon.